Kearns Canyon. We're here today to show you the finished product of the Green Dream Machine. We've been on the road for 25 days or so now. Uh, we've been uh, trying to uh, document just you know one one little journal page every day, just to um, just to show kind of what's going on. So like five years from now, you know what's up. But um, yeah, she's been uh, running good. We've been about like 1,500 miles, going about 50, 60 miles a day. Um, solar's been doing good. Got 200 watts. Um, we died a little bit in the Pacific Northwest, but it was super rainy, so we couldn't get any solar. But, um, yeah, we just got our little charge controller, and it's charging now. Um, got our little battery gauge. Shows it's 100%. Um, everything's working, everything's labeled. Uh, it shows a little red dot if a fuse blows. Um, yeah, we got our cat tower. Yeah, we didn't want to get rid of it because it was kind of like the only thing in our apartment that we really used and the cats used it. So they don't use it now really, so we might get rid of it. <laughs> or I might just uh, chop that top part off so I can see a little yeah, better. Anyway. But we just got our wall of stuff here. Got a couple pictures, our map. Um, well, yeah, we're somewhere... Somewhere around here ish. We're going to Las Vegas and possibly Phoenix and up to maybe Utah or Colorado. But um, got our clock hung up, first aid kit, um, just some pictures, all our lights and everything's still working. Um, got our little key holder so when we uh, get in, we can hang our keys. Started collecting some magnets. Um, this is new. And the Oregon 101. We took the 101 all the way from Oregon to San Fran. And then uh, Rocky Mountain National Park and Red, Red Rocks. And we just left Yosemite. Um, that was from a past, that was from a past trip. But um, anyway. Our dinette set's been holding up. Table's still looking good. Um, just bed, you know, it's just been been loving the queen. Much noon sleeping. Just a little storage for stuff. Our fantastic vent is great. Um, we got three lights. High and a low. Um, one there. And one here. Curtains we tend to slot and then tie together. This way we get most most of the light in and least obstruction. Kitchen, you know, we pull our grill out and we hook it up to here. Um, that runs underneath here to our propane tank. Um, just basic storage, just food and. Too many dishes. Too many dishes and this fancy it slides back in. Uh, to start grill, um, we got uh, our saran paper, all that goodies. Um, our food storage, keep most of our fruit up there that doesn't need to be refrigerated. This is mostly our knickknacks, cat food. Yeah. Extra litter, grocery bags, you know, water bottles. That's where we keep the cat food that we pour. And this is the little box that that has a vent going to the outside. That's, uh... And then we have our, um... Dometic fridge that we, uh... We just kind of tie down when we're driving and we let it go and then we uh, just pull it out 
It's a 65 liter dual zone. We're just using it as fridge mode right now. It holds uh, quite a lot. Um, I'd recommend it. Uh, we just uh, it doesn't pull a lot of power. We only have 230 amp hours, 200 watts. We died once with the no sun. We've been on the road for 24 days and we have not died uh, since then. And um, well. you know it's been keeping our food fresh. And uh, yeah, but our heater broke. So we had to get a new one of those, which that one was only two months old. So hopefully this one will last longer than two months. But uh, yeah, if you have any questions on uh, how anything was done or where I got stuff or, you know, this nice gentleman, uh, Steve, he's uh, Willow Tree Northwest. I'll tag him on the uh, bottom of the link. He made us this beautiful table and the beautiful clock. Um, but yeah, just, uh, let us know if you have any questions. Y'all have a nice day. Bye. Bye.